After 16 years of delay, the Minister of Transportation, Roti Miyamichi, said a committee has been put in place to work out modalities and develop guidelines for the disbursement of the 200 million US dollars, equivalent to 72 billion naira, that has accrued under the Cabotage Vessel Financing Fund, CVFF. President Muhammad Buhari said the partial closure of Nigeria's borders was not solely as a result of food products, particularly rice, which were being smuggled into Nigeria, but also because arms and ammunition, as well as hard drugs, being ferried into the country. The Federal Airport Authority of Nigeria, FAN, has issued a travel advisory to air passengers traveling through any of the country's international gateways following the spread of the deadly coronavirus. The virus broke out in China recently and has so far killed about 9 persons in the Asian country. Coronavirus symptoms include runny nose, cough, sore throat, possibly headache and fever, which can last for days. The virus is highly communicable and has already spread to countries like Japan, Thailand and South Korea. And in response to the recent increase in the waiting time of vessels calling at the Lagos Ports Complex, Apapa, the Nigerian Port Authority (NPA) said it had met with shipping companies and time operators and arrived at decisions aimed at immediately resolving the congestion. Mm -hmm.